Just we have to kill Bill. Bill Dotrieve. Bill's already dead. Oh. Hey Bill, what are you Damn doing it. up there? Hank, just trying to kill myself. Actually I learned something about um so you know that at the end when uh Uma Thurman uses those pressure points to kill up Bill. So a lot of that is loosely based off of um when it comes to get like massage therapies and such, put the fucking ocarina away. So I saw a video where a kid actually goes to a massage place in New York, and the the massager he gives what is essentially the most like painful massages, but in a sense like it feels good while doing it, but it's also painful at the same time. It's that kind of thing. Well, come on. You have to use your arrow. Damn or a hook shot. there was one in here and uh, no i don't think i want that right now if you go to the top western corner of the map you'll find a place where you can use a bomb to unveil a hidden location where a piece of heart is oh yeah yeah, yeah and i sent you a screenshot of where that location is all right let me take a look again oh so it's like north east no northwest west. northwest yeah, you should be able to see it on the yellow portion of the map that I sent yeah, you. Yeah, that's where I saw it, so... Uh, I still gotta get Apana. Apana is best horse. Yay! Best mode of transportation in the Zelda franchise. Yeah. I've seen a uh, picture of a ponified version of Apona, where it's just like, it's it'll give like, given like a cute expression while laying uh, flat on its back. <laughs> like, I'll have to look up the picture and find it. Oh, let's take a look again. Oh, okay, so it's a little more west. Uh, there's uh -oh. supposed to be a tree around here? Yes, there is. Oh, do I have to blow it up? Yep, oh, you yeah. have to use a bomb at the precise location. Oh. And this is where the stupid agony comes into play. Okay, so it's kind of at the direction where they have that one path at where the ranch is. All right. Let's go really Almost. Mm -hmm. No. Come on, this way. Oh wait, it's uh this way. No. There we go. All right. Uh, I can't see the stream for some reason. I'll have to. Wait, you can. Leave. Or right, hold on, let me try this again. My. Oh, there we go. There we go. Ah, da, 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 da. Come on. Swim back. Watch out for the... Yeah, I saw that. Hey, bastard. How you doing? Hmm. What Wonderful. Oh, yes. Now you just got it. Or can you not get it? Can you die for it? Oh. <laughs> Either the iron boots or the golden scale. Yeah, it's one of those two. God, I don't remember the iron boots. Can, What's up? You can always come back later. Yeah. Well, we're about to go to uh, sunrise. I got uh, 60 rupees. So do All I right, so you've got enough... You've got enough to challenge Tal to challenge Ingo again. Yeah, so do I have to go through the whole process again and then race him? Yeah, sadly so. Oh man, that is that sucks ass. Can't do much about it though. No use to complain. Ooh, there's a big po. Yeah, that po can fuck off. Actually if you send that to the Po collector in ruined Hyrule Castle Town, he'll give you something. I remember that. Um, at one point when I was in the dungeon, I was like trying to let it go. And what does Link to? He fucking chugs it. Pay me 10 rupees and you can ride. Sure. I, I... You got your Ocarina of Time on hand? Yep. Oh, yes. Because I guarantee you, riding one of those regular horses ain't going to do squat. Yeah. 
There you are. Hey, Epona, how you doing? All right. So there is... No, 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 no. And you're stopping. Please don't do that. There we go. Now I can uh, properly steer. No, come on. Got it. There's five rubies. Got it. All right, now. Ugh. Come on. Yes. All right. Peaches, 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 peaches. Hi, Daph. Hello. <laughs> well, not exactly a theme song for a horse race. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, gee, I wonder what movie I saw today. Was it great? It was good. It was wonderful. It's one of those oh, movies where you're falling behind. I know. I was like, oh, shit. I ran out of those little stamina buttons. <laughs> you got your boosts. Come on. Oh. Fuck. Now you gotta go find 50 rubies again. Damn. Ruples? Ruples. Welcome to the Russia, motherfucker. In Soviet Russia, cat horse rides you. If you're that upset, yeah. how about another race? That 50. No, 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 no. Damn it. Oh. Shit. Koopaling. If I had an expanded wallet, I wouldn't mind, like, just going for another race immediately. Mm. How many gold skulltulas have you destroyed? Gold skulltulas? Uh, hang on. Because <clears throat> depending on how many you've destroyed, you can actually go to Kakariko Village and okay. see if any of those cursed guys have been reformed. Right. So or I restored. Killed, I killed 13. How many do you need for an expanded wallet? I think you might need 15 first. Okay. The best way to find them is the best way to find them is during the nighttime. All right. When the monsters come out to play. Yep. I'm guessing this boulder's got some like some kind of secret. secret. You can't you can't take care you can't do anything about that boulder until you've gotten the silver gauntlets. Okay. Which is a long ways away. So why not just head to Kakariko Village for the time being? Sure, sure. I gotta... Wait, hang on. Is it this it's in the northeastern part of the map. Yeah, I was going the other way around the whole time. Excuse me. Just wanted to do that. And you know, there's actually another way to get a piece of heart if you're interested. Okay. You have to race against Dampay the Ghost again. Oh. For a second time. Ha. Huh. Alright, so I only have 16. Oh, wait, that's, uh, that's the entrance to the forest, so it's right around... Akarai Forest. <laughs> what the fuck? Hey, I thought it was Kikori. Kikori? Uh, everybody has their way of pronouncing it. I always called it Kakarai Forest as a kid. I it's probably it Kikori way. first. Uh, Isn't it like Kakariko Village or something? Mordecai and Rigby? From oh. regular show. <laughs> <laughs> Mordecai and Rigby! Rigby! You're fired! Rigby! <laughs> I'm surprised he hasn't gotten an aneurysm yet. Considering that his upbringing was literally him developing anger issues. Yeah. He did get so angry he started melting things around him. Yeah. He and literally became the sun. And that's mainly because Pops threatened to fire him if he wasn't nicer to Mordecai it's and Rigby. I need you to yell at Mordecai and Rigby or you're fired! Rawr! He just fires a giant beam. 
<laughs> what is the matter with you two idiots? Cassette. Many things. What the hell is Cassette? Said quit being a little bitch. What's Cassette Beast? Cassette oh. Beast. It literally sounds like a combin like an '80s villain. It does. It, actually, roll into that tree. Oh. Also, I am going to do something incredibly stupid next next week. What are you gonna do? I am going to get a foldable phone. Why? Because I've been interested in it, and a reviewer I've been watching keeps talking about how good they are and how they've improved, and I'm just like... <sighs> are you talking about the Samsung? Oh, oh, you're talking about the Samsung thing Guess in the viewers, aren't you? Guess yeah. there's nothing in that tree. Yeah. yeah, I've heard good things about the phones. Yeah. Not to mention, I kind of want to sign up for my own phone plan, so... I mean, you're going to have to at one point. Go ahead. Yeah. I was just going to say, mean... AT and T sucks, so... Yes, they do. That. I will Sadly, say what I use. <laughs> yeah, right. I, 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 I personally think it's better to stay on a family plan, but that's just my opinion. Well, the thing is about the family plan is that the like the problem is is that AT and T as a service sucks, and not to mention it's just kind of tedious. Like, what would you what would you change it to? Just T Mobile because I used to be with them and they were pretty damn good. I'm I mean, with, you, know, uh, you do real like. Here's the thing. T-Mobile uses AT&T towers. Yeah, but the thing is, they give you unlimited data. You want to know how much data AT&T yeah, gives have. me? Yeah, you want to know much? what AT&T gives me? Two gigabytes of data! Oh, yeah, yeah. Like, I get unlimited data, and I get Hulu and Netflix with it, and Tidal, but who the fuck uses Tidal? The problem with... <laughs> I have T-Mobile, but the problem with T-Mobile is... It's just, like, the, I have, my service is usually spotty for some reasons. I don't know why. It I, is. Well, I probably... across the country with Stop. it, and I had. Yeah. I don't I've live never... in the country. I live in the city. Yeah. I've never had issues with T-Mobile at all. Like the only reason I switched with AT and T was just because my some AT and T person approached my dad, convinced him, "Hey, this plan is very good. You're gonna pay less," and he basically convinced all of us to switch with them. Oh, you got phone sharked. <laughs> Yeah. yeah, they basically convinced us. Oh, we'll we'll you if you switch to our plan, we'll give you new phones. You bastard! I kind of felt why bad. Why are you even, the why are you even trying to take down that Poe? Eh, he's being a pest. Not Shoot gonna it. lie, I That's may what I'm upgrade. And Except it's in the wall, so you can't even get it. Can't do shit. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. What was that, Riley? I may upgrade. Upgrade uh, when iPhone 15 Damn comes it. out, just because they I'm hearing that they're switching to USB-C for it. Yeah, there actually are. The, the UK government basically told them, enough with the lightning cables, you are going to use USB-C and you're going to like it. Yep. No. Because let's be real, nobody, it's kind of weird that, like, even though everybody follows whatever the hell Am um, Apple does, nobody has followed Apple's direction of... Hey, we should all use the lightning cable. To which every uh, company, every other company, just went, "No, we're gonna stick I to mean, the normal cables." To be fair, I use the lightning cable, and I use the actual charger. Well, the thing and about light, well, the thing about lightning cables is that one, they're only relegated to Apple, and two, Apple has a tendency of overpricing everything they have. Yeah, man. Like with, all, I'm, all I'm gonna say about it is. My phone with the light when it is on a lightning cable charger, I can hold a charge for like two and a half days. <laughs> you have to like, grab the gravestone and pull it, Golden. Oh, okay. Because oh, okay. like, think about it. At least with the micro USB cable, you can pay like oh. five bucks. Oh, okay. okay. I feel dumb now. <laughs> it's a very tricky dicky thing. So, uh, if anything, I just don't like that they got rid of the uh, the headphone jack. Yeah, that's what I hate about it too. And I see some people try to try to go and say, "Well, you know, Bluetooth earphones are good." Well, yeah, but they're only for conveniences. Once the batteries on those things run out, you don't have them anymore. That's why see, wired cables are a little, and at least in my opinion, better. Yeah, they get tangled oh. and they break from the inside. Oh, get up, and get they up. and and they break from the inside. But at least you're able to still buy wired earphones as much as you want. Whew, my pro was a close my one. my problem. No wait, it was this way. I I I'm a supporter of wireless earbuds because the way earbuds are made now, they can hold a charge for the majority of your day 
as in like like oh. the the knockoff pair I had, those suckers lasted like forty eight hours on a charge. And don't get me wrong, wireless earphones are pretty good. That's why I have AirPods. The problem is Bluetooth When you make it mandatory. Yeah, not to mention if it was an optional thing every once in a while, I no, wouldn't I mind it. Way. Because you know, it makes work much easier when you have like a blue like a um a wireless earphone hidden in hidden on yeah. one side and you're working without having to deal with the cord cable. Oh, yeah. yeah. Fuck Yeah, you gotta do this race in a minute. I know, and there's also those fucking flames, dude. They're such a bitch. Uh, Whoa, no. But on a on a positive note, yeah, the Mario movie was pretty fun. Because like, I'm not, I'm not gonna spoil anything. I'm just gonna say it was really fun, and I think people are too hard on it because oh, it, it's X and Y. But I'm not how gonna, are you really I, like? Honestly... I'm not gonna I'm not gonna say it's a great movie by any means. It's it's simple popcorn fun. Like that's all yeah. I'd say. Oh shit! I just oh, no. just movie. <laughs> like it's not as like as I I've understand. Seen, most people seem to like it. I'm not well, sure what you mean. Like, well, I'm only mentioning it because of a certain reviewer who gave it like such a beat. Yeah, he gave your it. movie sucks. He always he, is yeah. He's he, that, that's nothing new. He, he's he's yeah. got a thorn yeah. up his ass. The only yeah. thing I respect him for was him uh, completely. Um, Debunking the Kim of the White Lions. Yeah, because people wouldn't shut up about that. Yeah. I only Who are you like, talking about? Uh, uh, YMS. Your Adam, movie sucks. Adam from your movie sucks. Basically, I was about to say, I, I, I was about to ask, is it Angry Joe? Because he gave that movie a 5 out of 10. Eh. No, like, like five. Like the thing with the, with the criticism towards the movie is that some people are willing to give it a pass because it's a fun movie. But in Adam Johnson's case, he ripped the movie a new one by saying that it was poorly done and that they were only making references for the sake of making references and said the only reason the movie was po was becoming big was because of, quote-unquote, brand loyalists, which you could pretty much say that about every person who's into yeah, stuff. Hell, they could even say, this, they could say the same thing about him. You know, I could say that that type of argument doesn't work for something like the Lego movie. You mean a Mario movie is going to have references to Mario? You don't say. You don't say. The only reason I feel like he gave the movie a bad review. Oh, oh that oh, was thank a God. Oh, I was about. <laughs> <laughs> oh, I was about to say shit. You didn't make it, but no, you did. Oh.